नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम टू इन इट्स डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम ऑफ ट्वेंटी एट मे टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू सो इन दिस ब्रीफिंग वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट योर स्टडीज रियलाइज वेदर वेदर सिस्टम्स वेदर फोरकास्ट एंड वार्निंग फॉर नेक्स्ट फाइव डेज सो योर स्टडी वेरी हैवी रेन फॉल एट आइसोलेटेड प्लेस इज रिपोर्टेड ओवर सर्वेल एंड वेस्ट बंगाल एंड हैवी रेन फॉल रिपोर्टेड ओवर साउथ त्रिपुरा सो एज रिगार्ड्स क्वान्टिटेटिव वैल्यूज इन सर्व मैल एंड वेस्ट बंगाल नंगरा कटा रिपोर्टेड ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर बगरा कोटे नाइन सेंटीमीटर मेवरा एंड मूर्ति रिपोर्टेड एट सेंटीमीटर ईच एंड इन त्रिपुरा इन साउथ त्रिपुरा बेलोनिया एंड कंचनपुर रिपोर्टेड सेवन सेंटीमीटर ईच सो टूडेज हाईलाइट्स आर कंडीशन आर बिकमिंग फेवरेबल फॉर ऑन सेट ऑफ साउथ वेस्ट मानसून ओवर केरला डूरिंग नेक्स्ट टू थ्री डेज एंड नो सिग्निफिकेंट हीट वेव कंडीशन वेरी लाइकली ओवर the country during next five days so since today no monsoon advance has been occurred therefore the northern limit of monsoon continues to pass through yesterday's values that is 9.5 degree north 60 degree east etc and uh, we will see also the map next year and the conditions are becoming favorable for onset of monsoon over kerala during next two days already mentioned and conditions are also favorable for further advance of south indian monsoon into some parts of our even sea lakshadweep area during the ascent period so this is the map this is again yesterday's uh, nlm so there is no change in the nlm you can see here this blue line reported here for 27 and 28 may now these are the synoptic systems uh, one western disturbance known as a trough in western lees Uh, here, from here, uh, and uh, another trough in Western is also roughly eighty-nine degree east and uh, twenty-three degree north, and uh, a cyclone circulation lies over North Odisha and Navarod, and another cyclone circulation lies over North Central Karnataka and Navarod, and east-west trough runs from this Punjab to eastern parts of Uttar Pradesh, across Haryana and west of Uttar Pradesh. so these are the weather one map for next five days you can see that for day one over north india thunderstorm activity is likely over parts of western bihar region that is jammu kashmir himachal pradesh uttarakhand punjab north punjab north haryana north west uttar pradesh east uttar pradesh and also the storm thunderstorm with gusty wind also likely over west rajasthan today and thunderstorm with lightning likely over east rajasthan and hail storm possibility also also likely over today over this jammu and kashmir and as regards east india thunderstorm lightning and gusty wind is expected over these regions that is bihar jharkhand gangetic west bengal odisha and chatisgarh in gangetic west bengal gusty wind is reaching 40 to 50 expected and over jharkhand also and as regards northeast india heavy rain fall is expected over some and west bengal and assam and meghalaya today and uh, thunderstorm and lightning likely over all the three subdivisions that is arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya and nagaland manipur mizoram tripura so this is all about uh, this uh, northern belt now go to the south in sri india thunderstorm and gusty wind likely over these mid subdivisions that is Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Lakshadweep area, and South Central Karnataka today, and heavy rainfall also expected at isolated places over Kerala and Maharashtra, and thunderstorm activity at isolated places also likely over Andaman Nicobar Islands. So this is all about today's uh, weather warnings. Now go to tomorrow's weather warnings. So thunderstorm activity is likely to continue over these mid south regions, that is West and Himalayan region, that is Jammu Kashmir. Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, and uh, northern parts of Punjab, Haryana, northwest Uttar Pradesh, and east Uttar Pradesh, and also over East India, that is Bihar, Jharkhand, Odisha, and also over Central India, that is East Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh, and over North East India. So heavy rainfall is expected also over uh, this uh, Assam and Meghalaya and Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura tomorrow, and as regards. this coastal andhra pradesh telangana 
Ralsima, Tamil Nadu and Kerala, here also thunderstorm, lightning and gusty wind is expected at as places and uh, heavy rainfall is likely over Kerala tomorrow that is 29th May. On 30th May, thunderstorm activity over North West India will reduce, however, thunderstorm activity likely will continue over Jammu Kashmir and uh, Himachal Pradesh on 30th and uh, thunderstorm activity likely will continue over parts of East, Northeast and Peninsular India and uh, thunderstorm activity also likely over Kerala and Mahe and uh, Lakshadweep area and heavy rainfall is expected on 30th over Lakshadweep and uh, Kerala and Mahe and heavy rainfall is expected over somewhere in West Bengal and Assam and Meghalaya on 30th. On 31st, thunderstorm activity likely to continue over uh, this Jammu uh, and Kashmir national divisions and uh, Heavy rainfall is expected as isolated places over somewhere in West Bengal, Assam and Meghal, and Nagaland and Upper Mizoram Tripura, and thunderstorm activity over parts of Maharashtra, Telangana, Coastal and Pradesh, Kerala, and Mile, Luxury area on 31st. And on 1st June, thunderstorm activity at, at isolated places like over Jammu and Kashmir, and at isolated places also like over Chhattisgarh, Coastal and Pradesh, Lai Sima, Konkan and Goa, Madhya Maharashtra, Maratwal, and Kerala, and Mile, Luxury area. And heavy rainfall on 1st June is expected over Northeast India at as well places that is Arunachal Pradesh, Rajasthan, Meghalaya, Nagaland, Manipur, Mizoram, Tripura, and over Kerala. In summary, we can say that heavy rainfall is expected over Kerala during the next five days, and over Northeast India, parts of Northeast India also likely uh, during the next five days, and uh, over some in West Bengal, some specified date or dimensions, heavy rainfall is expected, and thunderstorm activity during the next two days is expected over parts of Northwest India and over East India during subsequent during next three days and over Kerala and Tamil Nadu during next four or five days. So this is uh, all about today's briefing. We will meet again tomorrow uh, with another episode of Daily Weather Briefing. Till then, bye-bye.